Welcome to Lined Musings. Today we're going to go through my Delphonics pouch. Here's a quick view of the front of my pouch. And this is the back with some extra pockets. On the front I have a International Tokyo Museum badge from my trip to Japan back in 2018. And here I have a, a Studio Ghibli keyring. And first up, we have my Zebra Sarasa click pens. These are probably my favourite pens to journal with. And here we have my five mild liners. I love these highlighters, they are in muted shades which works really well with my style and also they are double ended. And here we have my Pentel Cleaner in a 0.4. In the front pocket I have a Muji glue tape for my scrapbooking. In the back here we have my Zig Clean Color Dot markers. And again I also have these in a muted colorway. I think I'm missing one here. There it is. In the same pocket, I have my Tombow brush pens. These are the only ones I have. I probably have a couple more on my wish list, and then I'm probably done with collecting these. There's the brush tip on one end and just a regular sized texture on the other. Let's unzip this Delphonics pouch. I really like the zip on this pouch. It's super smooth. Inside you'll see I have a couple more pencil cases. Uh, this one I got from Korea. Um, and in here I just have a selection of my other pens and markers and pieces. I have my mechanical pencil, it is the Kuru Toga in 0.5. And then I have my white Sakura Jelly Roll. My two Fudonosuke brush pens in the soft and hard tip. This is a Mira Plus colour pen. I've never heard of this brand before, but I really enjoy writing with it. And some 0.5 lead. Let me just pop these down. And here are a couple Stabilo black fine liners in a 0.4 in black. And my Stedler Tri Plus Fine Liner in a brown. Here I have my Sakura Micron. My Brown Pilot Brush Pen. And my Oto GS1 Ballpoint Pen. If we go back into my Delphonics pouch, there is another pencil case. This one I got from Kiki K quite a few years back. And inside here we have my Crayola Super Tips. Now 
Now, if we look inside the pockets within my Delphonics pouch, we have some craft post-it notes. And in this back pocket, I have a pair of pinko scissors. And some white out. I also have an eraser. And here are just some page flags that I got from Japan that are really cute. I don't get much use out of them, but I'll keep them here for come that day I ever decide I want to use them. And here I have a washi tape cutter. And that's about it. That's everything that is in my Delphonics pouch. I hope you enjoyed this tour of my Delphonics pouch. And I'll see you in the next one.